Morning, y'all. It's August the 15th, and we've had 30-odd days of triple digits in a row, and everything in my yard is pretty well crispy critters by now. And yesterday, I was making a little walk around just to check on some things, and something caught my eye. This is way out on the far corner of our yard and I took a picture and I went online and looked it up to verify what I thought it was and I was right. This is an antelope horn milkweed. This is native to Texas. Its range is pretty much the Edward Edwards Plateau, which is west of me. I'm in the Blackland Prairie to the east of Austin. And this is beneficial for monarch butterflies. Most people around here think, well, milkweed, they, they like the milkweed, but the only thing that you can buy pretty much in the nurseries is tropical milkweed, which has a orangey yellowish flower on it. And while it's okay, this milkweed bloom coincides with the uh, migration times of the monarchs. So this is what they like to find when they come through our area on their migration pattern. This, uh, like I say, it's a native. And from what I see, it has a long tap root. So if you want to try to grow some, I'm going to try to collect seeds off of this and just sow them in the ground where I want them to grow rather than trying to germinate them inside. Uh, if you find one of these in your yard, make sure you don't pull it out because like I say, the uh, butterflies, the monarchs, this is their food source as they're migrating through our area because of the timing of its bloom. So always be on the lookout on in your yard for things like this. I'm wondering if I may have in past years just pulled this up thinking it was a weed because it didn't look like anything I had planted. So keep a sharp eye out for things like this that may pop up in your yard because you may have found a treasure as they say, one man's trash is another's treasure. And this little treasure I found yesterday. So, thank you, Lord, for bringing this to my yard. Don't go out and smell the roses now.